Hello, it's Naveed, Jacob Zavi in Cheshire, home cinema and technology specialist. Okay, right. I want to talk to you about home streaming, multi-room audio, and that's a big thing these days. Um, a lot of you will know Sonos. Some of you will know Denon. There's other brands such as Blue Sound. Right, um, Yamaha, they've been around for decades. Pianos, home cinema equipment, DJ equipment, commercial equipment, you know, loads of it. We all know Yamaha, we all know the Japanese, and they are you know, a global company. Right, so Yamaha have what's called MusicCast, the equivalent of Sonos. It's a multi-room audio brand of theirs, which where there's an app, and you have various Yamaha MusicCast devices around the home. So one of the entry-level Yamaha MusicCast units is the WX010. That is the equivalent of the Sonos Play One. And I'm very sorry to keep bringing in Sonos. I'll keep this video as a Yamaha focused review. Right, we're gonna go unbox this. Let's have a look. Okay, so, well packaged, environmentally friendly, and that's the buzzword these days, isn't it? And then here's the actual unit itself. I'll put the box to one side for the moment. Let's untape the plastic film covering. Okay, so let's put that over there. Right, okay, what we have is, there's the actual unit, quite a cute unit actually. Um, controls at the top, like the shiny glossed over, a bit like the Yamaha piano actually. Touch buttons, got a mounting point in the back, a lot of people like to have it hung on the actual wall. And then at the bottom we have Network socket, very important, and the figure of eight power lead. Right, it feels quite good. It's nicely wrapped in the Yamaha like um, speaker cloth all the way around, so it's aesthetically quite pleasing. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set this up, get it powered up, get it on the network, and we're gonna go through with the app and demonstrate its music features. But let me give you a few of the features of the actual unit straight off. 24-bit audio, Sonos only does 16-bit audio, so it's a lot more, you know, it's called high-res. There's things like Spotify, TuneIn Radio, Deezer, Tidal. These are all streaming music services. So um, it, it is a device that needs an internet connection. Um, we have other instances where people think they can just get it and it will work. No, we need an internet connection. It can work from music on your hard drive within the local network. We'll delve deeper into that in a bit more of an advanced video for those of you interested. But for now, we'll catch you in the next video. Okay, bye.